Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to this week's edition of the Scuff Weekly Skid, your action sports news and music roundup for the week. If you didn't know, the Von Zipper Air Nui trials were on last week in Chopu, and Jamie O'Brien took it out in some pretty massive six to eight foot swell, not to be missed. Sticko's back with another DVD review in true Sticko form. He's going to be reviewing a DVD today called Save the Big Fat Whales. In music, we catch up and go surfing with Ash Grunwald. But to get started, we're going to have a look at the cult Get Your Freaks Out Tour. It's been going around Australia to all the board riders clubs, trying to unearth the most underrated and underground surfing talent from around Australia. It's a pretty loose event, not like typical surf events, judged on the biggest freakish move that goes down in the water. There's been three stops already gone down, Nora Heads, Wollongong and the Tweed, but let's get cracking with all the action from stop four up at Gold Coast. Hi, this is Pally and you're at the fourth stop of the Get Your Freaks Out Tour. We're up the northern end of the Gold Coast. We've got the clubs consist of North End, M&M and Burley Point. We've got good little beach break conditions, good for airs, good for big laybacks. So, Gold Coast! Get the freaks out! Close to what I thought it would be So where's this gonna lead? Live a like a sheep My eternity like a goddamn dog on a leaf You know it seems to me Clearly gotta go and clean You can take a dog But you won't get nothing for free Yeah, yeah, whoa Is that really where I wanna be? Yeah, 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 you know You know you should have been yesterday Yeah, 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 whoa Is this really what you wanted to see? And now the crowd is talking. On this roundabout, now I gotta get out, out of this place. Cause I'm sick of waking up with ya. Yeah, 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 wow. Is this really where you wanna be? Yeah, 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 you know. You know you should have been here yesterday. Yeah, 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 wow. Is this really what you wanted to see? Welcome to the club, then your freaks out. First, <laughs> the jazzy sheets are so wet, we can't even. Let's <laughs> not stop us. Ibis's car just got smashed into by its head. <laughs> Thanks, Nicole. You threw a tent at my car. <laughs> It is pissing down out there. We're going to have two three-man semis. Instead, we're going all out with a six-man final. Don't go to all the comms that surfing really well, that's good. 
for like cold for an event like this, you know, it gives them a bit of exposure and lets everyone else see how like, good they saw it. Pretty much want to make a living out of surfing. Like, that's every surfer's dream, I guess. It's like, pretty hard to do, but you know, if you make it, then you're laughing, I guess. <laughs> Well that's it for the Get Your Freaks Out Tour, now we head to Tahiti for the Air Nui Von Zippa Trials. Oh my god, there's a fucking beast. The waves are just on fire right now. It's big, and, and some of the bigger ones are not rideable right now. Um, there's just too much water, and, and you know, there's some big ones coming in. You know, it, it's heavy out there, so you just gotta find the right ones and pick and choose, and just be smart about it. It's hard to explain how good this place is, it's just, it's amazing, you feel like you're close to heaven here, it's like, I was just saying to one of the lads out there then, it's going mate, every wave you get you're just praying to God that you come out or if you go over you're just praying and praying and it's just, it's a dream to come here and I'm so happy to feel so privileged to be here and be able to compete in this thing. Ball and um, I don't know, it felt like it was gonna be a little one. And the next thing you know, the thing was like eight feet, and I was like, oh shit, what do I do? <laughs> and the thing just ate me up, and um, I just jumped, and then I caught my board like this, and the board just whacked me in my face, whacked me in my lip, and I was holding onto my board going over the falls, and I was like trying to get rid of it, like, ah, get away, board. <laughs> and then um, got pounded, came up, and I was like, oh shit, and then it sucked me right back down, and yeah, it's been a very good day. Um, I got a fat lip and a sore eye, but still getting barreled. I'm taking down the wind, I'm bringing you down. I land in Greece, but I land in Spain. I'm taking a little bit, I'm taking a lot, baby. Oh, player, looking at you. I got the happy bit, I just can't lose you. Need to try here, leaving you with. Turn you over and see who next. Well, I'm a player with a whole lot of soul. Well, I'm a player, man, I'm playing for ball.
Monty from Tahiti. Congratulations, Jamie. Coming up next, Sticko's DVD review. <laughs> Welcome back. This week I watched this movie called Save the Big Fat Whales. And no, no one's going to save fat chicks on the beach in England or anywhere. It's a story about a bunch of electric guys living the dream, having a great time. A guy called Rasta does a pretty amazing thing. He goes to a very confronting place in Japan and trying to stop these dolphins getting slaughtered. Rass actually is walking the walk and not just talking the talk in this one and um, quite proud and commended, commended. There's a sick little section of little Richie from the bra who's kicking ass in the cage. Yeah bro, and getting barreled holding up floaty toys. There's a good message behind this movie, go out and get it. Support everything that this pushes and save big fat whales. And check it later guys, I'm giving it three and a half stars. One time, cause I got it like that. Now throw your hands up with me, we're taking it back. I wanna go to Mum's house, cause that's where it's at. We check it. Line over for the big boy map. But all again is bling bling and all that crap. The three agent crew, see, well, we're taking it back. I wanna go to Mum's house, cause that's where it's at. We check it. Line over for the big boy map. But all again is bling bling and all that crap. The three agent crew, see, well, we're taking it back. What? Searching reality, clarity climbs back to me. In fact, you see the odds have been cheated and bombs strapped to me. I'm only a suicidal lyricist with lyric tricks, and when it hits, the room buzz in a little bit. Audio strapped to kill a metric coma weapon. You're forgetting heal the herder than the bass. What I'm protecting in a world full of m and So go to your local surf shop and save the big fat whales. But right now, we go surfing with Ash Grimoire. <laughs> Music I can do, <laughs> I just sort of take it for granted, whereas surfing, uh, I feel like I'm always still learning about it, so it's really exciting. I don't know, I only started that when I was an adult, so it's, I feel like an old grom. Like, um, I'm always stoked to go for a surf as many times as I can a day whenever I'm home or anywhere on tour, I'm just sort of really enthusiastic about it, try and lift different um, boards and different stuff, and I still am about like that about my music too, but to me, it's really weird if I meet somebody who says, yeah, I used to surf all the time and now I don't. It's like, what? How did that happen? What happened to you? What made you, did you get attacked by a shark or what? You know, how could you stop surfing? And then I end up telling them off and it becomes really ugly <laughs> and inappropriate. <laughs> Going out in front of a huge crowd is really easy. I feel like for me, the hard bit was when I was playing to 10 people. Like, you set up your gear and you go out in front of thousands of people, you know there's going to be a good vibe, you know, you can't really go wrong. Whereas pulling into a barrel, you can go wrong. <laughs> and I frequently do. <laughs> Yo guys, if you like what you've seen in this week's episode, go download the podcast at scuff.tv. Also, while you're there, we've got tickets to give away to Obese Records Block Party 5 Tour, which is a hip-hop tour going on around the country right now. So sign in, sign up. I'm signing out. I'll see you next week. Ew. Peril.